In this video, we'll set up Google Pay on this Galaxy Watch. For this to work, ensure that the watch is connected to a phone. So, let's get started. First thing we'll do is swipe up on the watch to open the app screen. Find and open Google Play. On this interface, tap the search icon. Type in Wallet here. We'll see Google Wallet on the top. Tap the install button. It will take a few seconds to download. Tap the open button to open it. Basically, to use Google Pay, we must set up a screen lock. Tap this blue button to set one. I'll choose the pin method and set a pin. Once done, Google Wallet will open automatically. Swipe left on these introduction screens. From this point, we need our phone because we'll add a payment card over there. Also, ensure that you have the Google Wallet app installed on your phone. If not, download it now because we'll need it. Then tap this plus icon to open wallet on your phone. From here, tap the add to watch button. We don't need this watch for now. Tap the first option. It will take a few seconds to load. Then on this screen, you might notice some payment cards. Those are saved to my Google account already. If you like to add one of those, click on it. Otherwise, tap the top option to add a new one. There are multiple ways to add one. We can just take a photo of it or choose this option to tap the card on the back of the phone to record details via NFC. I'll simply choose the manual method to add the details. Some of the information is pre-filled because I've added cards before. Still, I'll update the outdated information. Then click this more button. Next, we'll tap this blue button to continue. Then are the terms and conditions. Scroll down here to find the accept button. It will take a few seconds to process everything and show us this card verification screen. Here, there'll be at least one way to verify your card. Some examples include SMS code, calling your bank, and verifying through your banking apps. I'll choose the SMS code method. Also, you see this number? This comes from your bank, not from your Google account. So if your old number is here, you should contact your bank or the card issuer to update it. I'll get an SMS code to put in here. After this, you can make Google Pay as the default app on your watch. Let's skip it here and then click OK on the next screen. Now let's go back to the watch. If you open Google Pay now, you'll see this card added. Let's make it the default first. Tap this button and then from here, select Google Pay. Then press the back button on your watch to go back. Here we go. This is the added card. Now let's see how to actually use this app. The video was recorded while paying with Samsung Pay, but the process is the same. This is a payment terminal. When you see the amount on the screen, open Google Pay. Then just tap your watch on that terminal like this. You'll hear a beep and see the approval message on both the terminal and the watch. If you have multiple cards in Google Pay, you can tap on a card and make it the default from here. Also, tap the open on phone button to see options on your phone. We can see the recent activity, make it default, call the card issuer and remove it from Google Pay. On receipts, you'll find this card number. This is a virtual number that Google Pay displays to protect your card details. So this was using Google Pay on Galaxy Watch. Thanks for watching and please put in your comments below. Catch you later. Take care.